Hey, hey, hey guys, it's Camilla Nay, and I thank you, thank you, thank you so much for clicking this video. So, I'm at the office today, so if you do hear some noise in the background, it's just pretty busy here today. Uh, business is getting back and running, dealing with this pandemic that's going on in the world. But I hope you guys are all staying safe, and let's get straight into this video. The number one tip when walking into an audition room. When walking into an audition room, you want to make sure you walk in with confidence. You want to make sure you walk in there with a smile, happy, excited, really pleased that they're allowing you to come into the audition room. Because as soon as you go into the audition room, that is when the audition starts. It doesn't start when you start acting. It starts as soon as you walk in that room. So when you come into that room, make sure you walk in with confidence, a nice, happy personality. You're pleased to be in there and you thank them, thank them, thank them so much for allowing you to be there. It's two. Make eye contact with the directors, casting directors, or whoever's in the room. Make eye contact with the casting directors that's in the room. You want to make eye contact with them because that is grabbing their attention. That's getting their attention fully. It's okay to look on the side while acting or looking at a point on the wall or whatever. That's perfectly fine too. But if you want to grab their attention and you want to walk in the audition room and nail it, make sure you can get eye, have some eye contact with them. Even if you just have eye contact with them while talking. That's fine. And then when you start acting, you look at something else. That is perfectly fine. But make sure while, especially while you're talking, you make eye contact with them. For sure. For sure. Now, sometimes when you walk into an audition room, there might be a chair or um, a table or something. I don't know. It might be something in there where they, they're going to ask you, oh, you can use that prop if you want while you're acting. Use it. Use it. Don't say no thank you. Don't say, oh, it's fine. Thanks anyways. No. Use it. And figure out. You have to. Your brain has to be on go fast. Figure out how did everybody else use their chair and use it completely different. If you think everybody was sitting in it, don't sit in it. Walk around it. Sit in it for a second. Get up. I don't know. Do something different that you know, okay, I'm pretty sure everybody probably sat in this chair for the entire time they did their uh, monologue or whatever. <clears throat> Excuse me. Do it differently. Don't sit in it all the, the entire time you're recording. Sit in the beginning or sit in at the end. Do something different. I don't know. But use whatever props they're offering you. Do not say no thank you. They're giving you props. They're trying to make your audition better and more entertaining. So use the props that they give you. Just figure out a different way on how you can use it. When they say start, go ahead or uh, you may uh, proceed or however telling you to go ahead and start your audition, start. Start on time. I'm sorry. I'm not sure if it's loud or really loud in the background, but they seem loud to me. But I apologize if it is loud. But start. Do not say, oh, one second. Or trying to figure out something. Just start it. Just start it. Because if you don't start it, they're going to look at you like, oh, this person isn't ready. Oh, my God, this is annoying. They're going to be thinking all bad kind of things. So make sure when they give you the go to go, you go. You do it. You start. And you rock that audition. You know that audition. Tip number five. I'm not sure if I'm saying all the numbers or not, but I believe this is tip number five. Follow directions. Take directions. If they tell you to stand on that X, you go stand on that X. If they tell you to move up, move up. If they tell you to back up, back up. If they tell you to stop, stop. And I know some people that come in and literally when I tell them to stop, when I'm auditioning them and I tell them to stop, they don't stop. They keep reading. I'm like... Am I, am I, are you deaf? Like, I don't, I don't get it. Like, when they tell you something, you listen. Because then they're not, if you're not listening at an audition, they're not going to want you on set. They're going to be like, this person can't even follow directions when we're giving them simple directions at an audition. You can't even follow the rules and directions at an audition. Like, I'm not going to want you to be a part of anything that I'm doing on set while filming because I'm like, this person don't even know how to follow directions. So I don't want to work with this person. I really don't. Now, sometimes they might give you input or they might say something to you at the end. One thing I tell people, listen. Listen to what they're saying and respond. Respond afterwards. Thank them for giving you uh, that advice or thank them for whatever they're saying. Listen to them. Don't interrupt them. Don't talk while they're talking. Don't try to cut them off to say something. Just be quiet. Listen 
And then respond afterwards. Respond afterwards. And always respond. Even if it's, okay, thank you. No worries. Whatever. Even if it's a simple thing, respond. But you have to respond after listening. But make sure you respond. Don't have them give you a whole story on how, uh, you know, you were good, but they thought you did a lot of movements or whatever. Sometimes they might tell you that... Um, and at audition, they might tell you your flaws. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Sometimes they just let you go out the room. So if they give you some critique or whatever, listen. Don't interrupt them. Don't talk. Listen. Then respond after and always respond, even if it's just thank you. Respond. Now, the this is an important step. Do not walk into the audition room as your character. I feel like this is a big no-no, and some people think that's a good thing, but it's not. It's really not. Do not walk into the audition room as your character. Walk into the audition room as yourself. Then, when they tell you to start, then you be that character. I know some people that came in audition for a character, and uh, the character was like this mean, ignorant person, and they walk in the room portraying that character. But we don't know if you're portraying that character or we could just be thinking you just have a nasty attitude. We don't know. That's something you don't want them questioning. So walk in, be yourself, have an awesome personality, be happy, smile, be thankful that you're there. Seriously, guys, th be happy that you're there. Be thankful that you're there. Walk in the room as yourself. Let them, they're only seeing you for about two, three minutes, if that you want them to know you is they know the, a little bit of you because they're not going to really know you. They're going to know your acting skills, but they're not going to know you. They know you when you walk in that room. Hi, how you doing? My name is Camilla Lene. I'm here to audition for the role Martha. I don't know. You know, be happy. If you come in and Martha is this crazy person, you're like, hey, how you doing? My name is Camilla Lene. I'm auditioning for Martha. Like, that's dry, boring. I'm not going to want to work with that Camilla Lene. But if you walk in the room, hey, how you guys doing? My name is Camilla Lene. I am here to audition for the role of Martha. Thank you guys for having me. Then that Camilla Lene I would love to work with. So you guys have to understand, don't walk into the room as the character. Walk in the room as yourself. Be happy. And I'm being honest, if you're a dry, boring person, you better fake it. Fake it till you make it. You heard that before? Fake it. Because if you walk in a room and you're a dry, boring person, I'm not going to want to work with you. I'm just going to be like, uh, I I'm not going to want to work with you. You're boring, to be honest. When you all, and I always tell everybody, walk in with a smile, leave with a smile. Think them when you come in, think them when you leave. Okay? So, be happy, smile, think them. Let them know you appreciate their time because it's a lot of time that they're <laughs> spending on this. Appreciate them. Thank them. Let them remember you as a respectful person. Let them just grab grab something. Have them remember something about you. Oh, yeah, you remember that person? She was so nice. She thanked this. She smiled. She left. She came in with a smile and thanked this. She left out with a smile and thanked this for her time. Nobody really does that. Thank them. Let them appreciate. Let them know that you appreciate them watching your audition okay and i think that boss wrapped up my video um i don't know did i say that word i think that about wraps up this video <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys if you have any suggestions down below put it in the comments down below any suggestions i don't care what it is like i say all the time even if it's one question that you feel is stupid Put it down below, and I will make sure I answer it just for you. If you have 5, 6, 20 questions, put it down below. I got you. I'm going to answer it because I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please keep coming back for more. Again, we post every Tuesday and every Friday. I love you guys. Peace.